OpenAI Swarm, one of the most popular AI agentic framework which was released by OpenAI. As you can see here, within one week it got 13,000 stars. It simplifies the process of creating AI agents. AI agents are nothing but independent AI systems working together to solve complex tasks. So if you have a complex task, you can use AI agents to solve that complex task, automate any repeated tasks, and that will increase your productivity. But how you can run this locally on your computer and 100% private. So in this video, we're going to see how you can run this OpenAI Swarm 100% local, private, using Llama 3.2. We'll be trying using Olama and also we have LM Studio for option. We're going to create AI agents and automate internet research tasks. As you can see, when you search for AI news, you get multiple links and you need to go and click all these links to get an understanding. What if you have an AI agent which can go and click all these links, get all the data and able to summarize it for you? That's exactly what we're going to see today. Let's get started. Hi everyone, I'm really excited to show you about how you can create AI agents using OpenAI Swarm. And we are going to create news search agent and then editor agent. So the news search agent will have internet search tool that is DuckDuckGo search. And we have editor agent who is going to use that data and summarize it for us. But before that, I regularly create videos in regards to artificial intelligence on my YouTube channel. So do subscribe and click the bell icon to stay tuned. Make sure you click the like button so this video can be helpful for many others like you. First step, in your terminal, pip install swarm package and DuckDuckGo search for internet search and then click enter. Now it's installing those packages. Next we are going to go to olama.com and download the olama model. That's how we are going to run llama 3.2. Once after you download, just type olama pull llama 3.2 and then click enter. This will download the llama 3.2 model. Export OpenAI model name llama. 3.2 and then click enter. Next export open AI base URL and then the URL localhost 11434 slash v1. This is for Olama and then click enter. Create a file called app.py and let's open it. Inside the file from DuckDuckGo search import ddgs then from swarm import swarm agent and importing date time. Next we are getting the current date to get the latest AI news then we are initializing the swarm package. This involves three simple steps. First to create internet search tool, then create AI agents and finally create workflow that is combining all agents together. So step number one, creating internet search tool, creating a get news articles function. That's where we are passing the DuckDuckGo search tool. Just initializing DuckDuckGo search and passing the topic and the date to search and it's going to return five results. That's it. So that results will be sent to the next agent. So for now, we have created the internet search tool. Now step number two, create AI agents. Number two, create AI agents. First, we are going to create a function called transfer to editor agent. So this function is used to hand off the task from one agent to the another agent. We have two agents. One is a new search agent. So once after the task is completed, it will hand off to the editor agent. That's what this function does. Next, news agent. It's just simple function agent and we are just giving the instruction you provide the latest news article for a given topic and the tool we are providing is get news article so that is the get news article function so this could be any of your tool so even if you have your custom tool or custom software any api you should be able to replace that here and also modify this function to integrate any tool with this swarm now we have completed creating the internet search tool and the new search agent and finally, the editor agent. Editor agent to edit the news. And it's very simple. It's going to review and finalize the news article for publishing. Now the final third step, creating the workflow. Step number three, create workflow. Now we're going to create a function called run news workflow. And it's very simple. First step, inside the workflow, we are calling the news agent using this client.run function. And then get the results from the news agent and pass it to the editor agent by calling client.run. Then at the end, we are returning the result. As simple as that. Just a few lines of code. And we have created the workflow. At the end, we are going to run the function. That is the workflow. Just calling run news workflow and passing AI. So this is the topic. So this topic will be going here and then passed to the agent, first agent. As a quick overview, first we created the internet search tool. Then we created AI agents 
news agent and editor agent and finally we create the workflow to make them work together. Now I'm going to run this code. In your terminal, python app.py and then click enter. Now first it's going to the news agent using internet search tool and searching about AI in October 2024. Then that details will be passed to the third agent and the third agent is now finalizing writing a proper news article with title and every single news for this month. Nobel Prize, AI's role in combating fraud, US government's push for responsible AI use, IBM's Granite 3.0. As simple as that. One of the most advantage of using this tool is that you are able to directly work with OpenAI SDK, which means these calls are direct without any abstraction. So you can clearly monitor at each step what it's happening. And even if any error happens, you should be able to fix it directly. You can also easily integrate LM Studio. Just download LM Studio from lmstudio.ai. Once after opening LM Studio, you should be able to click the search that is a discover icon here and then click Llama 3.2 and then download the model. Once after you download, go to the developer icon here, select the model Llama 3.2 and then click load the model. Then click the start icon here. That's it. And you have the URL that is the base URL here. I'm going to copy the URL. Same as before, exporting the OpenAI base URL, localhost 1234 slash v1 and then click enter. Now just type python app.py and then click enter. Now this is using LM Studio. As you can see the log here, it's automatically generating the response. And here you can see it's working behind the scenes generating. At the end, you get the finalized edited AI news here. Considering you already like this OpenAI SOM, I've already created another video which covers the basic which is required for you to understand how the whole thing works. So I highly recommend for you to watch that and I will put that link here. So just click that and watch it there. I will see you there.